This is CBS 2 News at 5 p.m. Right now on CBS 2 News at 5 and streaming on CBS News Los Angeles, only on CBS 2. Roughed up and robbed. A restaurant on Miracle Mile is the target of some brazen thieves as stunned customers looked on. Good evening, everyone. I'm Pat Harvey. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. I'm Jeff Vaughn. Well, the robbery stunned customers inside the Fortune House restaurant. And now police are trying to track down those brazen thieves. CBS 2's Jeff Nguyen is live along Miracle Mile with more of that video and the witness who saw it all go down. Jeff. Pat and Jeff, the grab and go robbery happened while this restaurant was filled with customers. And one witness told us that the crooks were gone in about 30 seconds. Security camera video shows at least four men in a snatch and grab robbery at Fortune House Restaurant. The robbers wore hoodies and masks as they made off with a couple of cash registers. One employee was pushed during the tussle around nine Tuesday night. Oh my God. Oh. Yeah, it's just completely destroying everything. Siva Kolstad lives in the Miracle Mile area. She says she eats at the neighborhood Chinese restaurant about once a week. It's really scary to know that things like this are happening in a restaurant that we love in a neighborhood that we enjoy. The security cameras also captured stunned customers during the robbery. Pamela Clay was among them. And then, of course, you're looking to see whether or not they have weapons. You just want to make sure, you know, because there were other people there that people were going to be safe. One of the men wore a yellow hoodie while the other three had dark colored sweatshirts. Detectives say they initially came in and pretended to order takeout. They didn't say a word. They just came in and grabbed and left. Management shared the video but declined to be interviewed. We were told no one was hurt. That's horrible. Longtime customers say they enjoy the food here, but it's the staff that has them coming back. And I think it's just tragic um, because I don't think that anybody should have to be in fear of where they're working, having things like that happening. And if they had guns or whatnot, like they could have been so much worse. And detectives say that the suspects ran off on foot. And after viewing that video closely, investigators do not believe these were the same people behind a smash and grab jewelry heist in Beverly Hills yesterday afternoon. We are live in the Miracle Mall area. Jeff Nguyen, CBS 2 News. All right. Thanks so much, Jeff.